Oh, I look like a ghost. I'll take it from my mouth. You might, yeah, you're extremely pale. Oh, that's crazy. Why is it like that? <laughs> I don't like it. That's what they did in After Effects. Okay. I well, don't think the red lipstick's helping either. I don't think so either. <laughs> okay, well, hey friends, my name's Gabrielle, and welcome to Previous Reads, and I look like a ghost today, apparently. And I think that you always look like that. I, apparently so, and this is... Christian. And today, we are reacting to the second official trailer for Avengers Endgame. So basically, Endgame and Game of Thrones are coming out at around the same time, and what that means is we're just gonna die, yeah. apparently. It's a good time to be a nerd. It's a great time to be a nerd. This couch is very squeaky. Yeah. All right. So, are you sure it's are you sure it's not because you're haunting it because you're a ghost? I am a ghost apparently today, so <laughs> there is that. Um, we switched out the background a little bit because the light was coming from a weird source today, and so that's part of the reason why I look like a ghost and why you see shelves that normally aren't in my reaction videos. Um, I kind of like it like this because that means we don't have to set up as much stuff, but I just don't like how pale and ghostly I look. But yeah, without further ado, we're just gonna go ahead and watch the trailer yep. and give you our opinions on it. It's gonna break our hearts into smithereens. Yay! All right. God, seems like a thousand years ago. Ooh! Oh wow! <gasps> oh! I remember. I came Iron Man. Yeah. That was a long time ago. Realized I loved you. Aww. Yeah. I went through. I'm just going through all the past. No more surprises, but I was really hoping to pull off one last one. Hmm. Yeah, he's gonna save himself. The world has changed. None of us can go back. Captain America. Mm -hmm. Are we going through all the movies and black and white flashbacks? <gasps> oh! Hey! hey! And sometimes the best that we can do. Ronan, yeah. Is to start over. That's awesome. Yeah. Oh, our flashbacks so much. Thor. I love the Sin City Look black and white and red yeah. kind of thing going on. Yeah. Oh, bye, Sam. Yep. Rip our hearts out. suits that's awesome that's that's so awesome I love this oh. hey I like this one <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome that's oh. so good. Oh. oh, that was awesome. Also, can I just say I hate the fact that you keep making me watch these because I'm trying to go into this like completely blind. No. <laughs> you can't say that because uh, you have to suffer with me. Oh, I hate you. Oh my gosh. Okay, I will say one thing. I hate the white suits. That looks... They're the space suits. That's the thing. They're, yeah. they're using them to go into outer space. I actually I'm, I don't know. I don't know any official things because, again, I haven't read up on anything. Maybe yeah. like one or two rumors. But... um. They're going to outer space. They're the spacesuits. Yeah. I mean, did you? Uh, everyone was there, including um, Nebula. Nebula. And Tony Stark. <clears throat> yeah. So, I'm pretty sure Captain Marvel was there too. We just didn't see her. Yeah. They don't, they don't want to tease her too much. Like, yeah. You know. We oh, know, completely. We know yeah. enough because of the last scene that she is going to be there. Yeah. But we don't know everything else. Like we just know that she's going to be there, obviously, yeah. because Captain Marvel just came out. Oh, completely. Which we haven't seen yet. So don't hate us. Actually, we were out of town traveling, and um, we just got back last night, and then this trailer dropped, and so of course we want to react to yeah. it. Um, and we're gonna. I'm actually gonna go see Captain Marvel tonight. And Christian, you are welcome to come join me if you want. I was just planning on seeing it tonight anyway. Oh wow! Thank you so. for letting me know in on your uh, plans. You're welcome. I thought um, we were in this together. No, <laughs> uh, not when it comes to fandom. <laughs> 
Um, so I don't really, like, I don't want to say too much yet because I know that seeing Captain Marvel is going to change how I view a lot of Endgame and how I view a lot of this trailer. And I don't think that it was, um, I don't think it was a coincidence. I think they definitely planned to drop this trailer, like, the week after Captain Marvel oh, has completely. come out. Yeah. Um, so I'm sure that there's something in the movie that will relate to this trailer that maybe I'll make a reference to after seeing it. Yeah. But just watching it, I just, I just get so excited. It's just so crazy that... This is the last movie we get. Uh, like this whole, the whole Marvel Cinematic Universe has build building towards this, up towards this movie. This one, and I thing, loved yeah. the flashbacks. I yeah. love that we started with Tony Stark and Iron Man and how it all started because that is really where this whole thing started. Without no. that, if that movie had never been made the way it was, it, uh, it none of this would have happened. Like it had to be the perfect storm, and it really was. Yeah. Not just you know um, Robert Downey Jr. Although as he Iron is Man. like oh completely perfect. like he, he he was like half of the reason why it was a perfect storm. Yeah. But everything else involved with it, right. it was just amazing. It was, and so it's just really cool that we got to see the flashbacks where each character started. Yeah, we got to see everyone kind of just doing their little training montage. Yep. The, um, obviously we saw a pretty big battle sequence. I mean, Ant Man right. and doing his little jumpy thing yeah. and then Captain America just uh, looking all dirty. And we shoveled. got teased of Kate uh, Bishop, right? Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, so we oh, saw that. So we know amazing. for sure that probably this is going to be Hawkeye's last Hawkeye um, appearance with Clint Barton. We don't know. Probably. Yeah, I mean, well, as Hawkeye, because then he goes to Ronan, right? Oh, I mean, he's Ronan yeah, right now. He's he, Ronan he, right now. I mean, in the comics currently, they're both active. That's true. So, you know, it might just be kind of that. Kind yeah, of thing. like passing of the torch. Yeah. So he can finally, like, actually retire. He literally gives her his old bow. <laughs> he has such. Okay, so I'm sorry to say something when I saw his haircut, and then I stopped because I didn't want to keep talking through yeah. the trailer. But oh my god, he has such like an emo depressive haircut. Oh totally. Like the I'm feeling all my feelings he, and I'm dark he is and edgy. And let him let him have I him. know, it's just that haircut. Let him have it's his haircut. It's just such like an angsty teen thing to do. <laughs> and I saw it, I'm like, oh I my won't god. lie. I understand why, yeah. but it's just it's so funny that like this is how he's changed and he has a haircut now. Honestly, like, that's if it. I was still in high school, that's the haircut I would try to get at. Oh, I know. Um, it's going to be so popular, this movie with all the angsty boys. Yeah, I love the fact also and that um, uh, Stormbreaker goes to Thor the same way mm -hmm. Mjolnir does. Yeah. So that, that's just a fun little yeah. thing about it. I don't have much else to say other than the fact Who that... Who was the oh. lady with the short hair? That was Remember her back to us when Thor was saying, I like her, about Captain Marvel? I don't Do remember you know who that. that was? No, there was like no, a scene no. with the was this lady. She had really short hair. I thought it was like Natasha Romanoff at first, but then her hair is red in this trailer, so mm. it's not her. But she has really short white hair. I just saw a glimpse and I couldn't see the face. And I don't know if maybe like they didn't show us the face on purpose. Maybe look, it's someone from Captain Marvel that we just don't know yet. I'll have to look at it. Short white yeah. hair. That's if you guys know like what I'm talking about, you know what I'm um, like. Which part of the scene I'm referencing? Yeah. Let us know in the comments down below because I would love to know. Um, I just saw that and I was curious so I didn't immediately place who that was, so I'm just wondering yeah. who it was. After this, I'll check it out. Yeah. But yeah, uh, this was a great trailer. This Honestly, was a great trailer. I'm um, very excited. It, they've been they've been perfectly timing this out. Yeah. Um, so that we can get, they like... They kind of had to. Yeah, they, I mean, they really did. They don't need to do much. No. This mm -hmm. is... If this was the only other trailer they released about this, it'd be fine. Yeah. Like, this this is all the hype you need about it. Yeah. You showed everyone, you, sh you, you got that nostalgia factor, yeah. you showed some exciting sequences, you right. show you gave a little tease to the comic book uh, fans mm -hmm. with Kate Bishop. Yep. Everything is, you saw everything exactly what you needed to see. Yeah. And, and you know, honestly, this trailer just does that. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry, just yeah. you said that you showing the scenes and the flashbacks. I'm really curious as to why they showed Sam and T'Challa. Like fading away, and then there was no and kind Scarlet of Scarlet Witch too. And Scarlet Witch, so I'm wondering if that's like hinting that we'll see like inside the Soul Stone at some point. Oh, I'm pretty sure, yeah. Yeah, you think so? Uh, yeah, okay. Ant Man is def. There's a whole thing with Ant Man. That's theory. true. That's yeah. right. They did introduce that. This, there's just so much in this trailer. There's so much. And the thing is, if if what I read is right, we've only seen like clips from the first 15, 20 minutes of the movie. Yeah, which is so, going to be insane that that yeah. was everything that's going to be in the first 15, 20 minutes. Yeah. If that's true, if that's really how it relates. Oh, completely, yeah. But, um, 
yeah, I'm really, I'm excited to see this movie. I'm sure that it's going to be, it's, it's going to take a couple watches to actually have everything sink in, I yeah. feel like, after all this time. I'm definitely going to go watch yeah. it like nine times. Oh, yeah, definitely. But um, those are our initial thoughts yeah. and feelings about this second official trailer. There's so uh, much. There's so much to unpack here. If you guys would like to see I... us go through and do like a scene-by-scene -scene analysis, kind of how like I did with my His Dark Materials predictions um, trailer video, then let us know in the comments down below. Um, we'll take the time and do that and really try to like dive deep yeah. into what's going to happen um, in our predictions for this movie. So if you would like to see that, let us know. Um, yeah. If you want to see more of Christian, you Hello. can find him on Twitter at Pacifist Pickle. Yep. If you want to see more stuff with me where I don't look like I'm fading away into whiteness, um, you can subscribe to my channel. I upload bookish videos twice a week as well as reaction videos like this whenever yep. something cool comes out that I want to react to. But for now, that's all I have for you guys today. So thank you so much for watching this video and we will talk to you guys later. All right. Bye. You look so pale. It is so it's funny. It's crazy. <laughs> it's like, oh, look at me. I'm Gabrielle. I'm haunting the couch and it's squeaky. <laughs> yeah, no, look. I'm in a haunted library. <laughs> I'm so done with you. <laughs>